Thank you for joining us for our final episode of Austin Wild Black History Month. This week we'll be talking about Old Anderson High School. My name is LaToya Devizen and I'm the African American Community Archivist for the Austin History Center. We can't talk about hallowed grounds in Austin and not mention Old Anderson High School. In 1889, the city of Austin created the first black public school. Anderson High School was originally named after E.H. Anderson, who was the principal of Prairie View Normal Institute. In 1938, it was renamed after E.H. Anderson's brother, L.C., or Loreen Cecil Anderson, to honor him posthumously. Students at Anderson High School received a well-rounded education, from its Capizio Club to its excellent football team and award-winning yellow jacket marching band. In 1971, the city of Austin's first black public school closed as a result of desegregation. The closing of Anderson High School had a tremendous effect on East Austin's community. No longer were the colors black and gold synonymous with East Austin yellow jacket pride. Those students who were not able to graduate from Anderson High School were bused to previously all white high schools. Now they kind of face the situation of being a black face and sometimes an often hostile all-white crowd. Anderson High School as we know it today reopened in 1973 and its first integrated graduating class graduated in 1974. Thank you for watching the Austin Wild Black History Month series. We hope you enjoyed exploring some of Austin's hallowed grounds. The Community Archivist Program is a valuable resource for the community. We work for you. I hope you feel free to come visit the Austin History Center or make an appointment with us. We hope to see you soon.